Yes guys, what's going on? Welcome back to the channel and to today's video. Now, this might actually be the very last video before the big move to Manchester. So, look, if that doesn't deserve a thumbs up on the video, I don't know what does. But yeah, today we're going to be talking about big trends that you're going to be seeing everywhere throughout summer 2023. Quick disclaimer though guys, don't, don't panic by into trends. Kind of use them as a tool to help find your style. Just hold off a bit, you know, hold off two, three, maybe even four weeks, then come back and think, do you, do you still really want that piece? Obviously, if you do and you have the budget, then, then you got something to really think about. Um, but another point before we jump in, a huge thank you to every single one of you for all the support on last week's drop from my clothing brand, Studio Du Jour. As always, you guys, absolutely smashed it so a huge thank you and honestly i i cannot wait to see you lot styling these pieces a lot of you or most of you now have probably already received the pieces and i've already been getting insta dms and people tagging me on instagram of you lot starting to style them and like there is no feeling like it it's the best feeling in the world and yeah as always i cannot thank you enough all the incredible support but yeah as always all the links to everything from my brand will be at the top of the description down below all right so let's jump into the summer 2023 trends and honestly no doubt about it there's only one place to start and that is jorts or jean shorts honestly these are gonna be absolutely everywhere this summer they they already are if you're into your i guess bermuda shorts then jorts in my opinion will be right up your street they're like a jeans version of bermuda shorts to me they kind of give off they give off all the kind of 90s skater vibes now you normally i guess kind of see these styled in more of a vintage aesthetic however my personal favorite is that more kind of minimal clean cut look. Now, some great places to grab these. Jaded London have some really solid options at some pretty affordable price points. Weekday also have some great options at a similar kind of price point as well. However, slightly kind of up in your budget allows you access to brands such as Levi's and even Carhartt. And to be honest, nine times out of 10, you're gonna get better quality out of these brands. All right, guys, so moving on to summer trend number two. And honestly, it just has to be the crochet shirt. And I know I know it's a piece that you've kind of heard me talk quite a lot about recently, but honestly, it's for good reason. The crochet shirt is absolutely everywhere. And it's a trend that I've heavily implemented into my personal style. What I really love about the crochet shirt is how they can kind of easily elevate a simple outfit and that's simply all down to that unique texture of the fabric and on top of that because of that unique fabric it also makes the shirt incredibly breathable as well which also just adds to the reason as to why they're the perfect shirt for these hot summer days so the one that i have the one that all you guys have asked the questions about is from zara but i did get the length shortened at my local tailor and honestly that made all the difference. I absolutely love it. You've also got About Blank. They have a beauty, which I believe is getting restocked soon. So definitely check that out. Then if you wanna really up your budget, this one from the brand Needles is an absolute beauty. All right, so next up, this isn't a kind of specific, I guess, trending item as such. It's more of a, it's more of a style or a look that I believe is going to be super popular and I guess kind of heavily trending this summer. And that is the pairing of shorts, socks and loafers. I absolutely love this look. Like it really gives off that classic, but at the same time, I guess kind of unique look. And it can honestly be styled within so many kind of different looks as well. You know, if you're into that whole vintage aesthetic, you can rock it. But if your style kind of leans into that more smart casual side of things, it looks equally as good. It's honestly a pairing that you're gonna see so much throughout the summer months. And 
It's a pairing, like I said, that I'm really excited to kind of start experimenting with and putting outfits together with as well. Okay, so moving on, the next trend for summer 2023 is going to be retro low profile sneakers. Now, I know this is a bit of an obvious one, and don't get me wrong, I still absolutely love my kind of runner style dad sneakers like you know the Asics Gel Kyano 14s, the New Balance 990s, they still have a prominent place in my rotation but the slimmer style silhouette also has to have a place as well you know the Adidas Sambas, the Onitsuka Tiger Mexico 66s, these simply have to be included because this summer they're gonna be everywhere. They definitely do give off a different kind of look as well. For example, let's say, you know, you're wearing some really nice wide um, black trousers, you know, an under vest, a nice flowy shirt, and then you pair that outfit with a chunky style sneaker. That can really kind of dress the outfit down. However, if you want to kind of lean into more of a smarter look, but at the same time, you still want to wear sneakers, switch out the dad sneakers for a pair of black Adidas Sambas, and you've got the perfect combination. So a few different options. You obviously have the Adidas Sambas, the Onitsuka Tiger Mexico 66s, but you also have the Adidas Gazelles. However, if none of those kind of take your fancy, have a look at the Puma Superliga OG Retros. They're honestly a solid option as well. Okay, so moving on to trend number five. Well, to be honest, I don't really feel like we can call this a trend. It's, for me personally, it's definitely more of a summer wardrobe essential, but either way, it is a tank top or just like a plain vest. These are simply a must have this summer. I genuinely believe this is actually an item that everyone needs in their wardrobe. They're absolutely perfect for layering. But on top of that, I've also been seeing a load of people rocking this just tucked into a pair of nice wide leg trousers as well. And honestly, I'm not gonna lie, that is a look that I absolutely vibe with. Like, you know, some wide leg trousers, a tank top tucked in, a nice kind of crossbody bag, some loafers on foot. You have a perfect, simple summer outfit. Trust me, everyone needs a tank top in their wardrobe. Honestly though, like, whether, whether it's to have, you know, as a standalone piece, an underlayer to a shirt, or even, you know, an underlayer to a slightly, I guess, more sheer top of some sort, a tank top is an absolute must for everyone this summer. You need one in your wardrobe. Those were my personal top five trends for summer 2023. But as always, I am intrigued to know what trends you feel like I should have included or what trends are at the top of your list this summer. Do let me know in the comment section down below. So yeah, come on guys, let's all smash the thumbs up button for this being the final ever video in this room where this whole YouTube channel started. Final video. Um, and also, I know I'm gonna get a load of questions about the cap. Let me know what you think. It's a sample, potentially coming out um, very, very soon. This is just a sample of the shape. So, oh, and the color. So yeah, let me know what you think. Well, that's it guys for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, as always, please give it a big thumbs up. Hit subscribe if you're new. Drop a comment down below. Go ahead and follow me on Instagram. It's basically a daily vlog. And I'll see you lot in the next one. Hopefully in the new apartment. Peace.